It's time to play Family Feud. Today we're celebrating the new Steve's All-Star Edition Family Feud board game. And now, give up for Steve Harvey. I appreciate everybody. I do. Thank you very much. Thank y'all. I do. Well, welcome to Family Feud, everybody. I'm your man, Steve Harvey. Woo! We got a good one for you for today. We're turning for their fifth and final day with the total 22765 bucks. From Atlanta, Georgia, it's the champs, it's the Carswell family. Woo! And from Canton, Georgia, it's the Simpson family. Woo! Everybody's here trying to win themselves some cash. And today, if the Carswell family wins today's game, they're going to drive out here in a brand new car. Plus, to celebrate my new All-Stars Edition board game found exclusively at Walmart, we're giving away a special prize to the family that wins today's game. Mm. Mm. Let's go meet the Simpson family. Mm. Hey, Tracy, how are you doing? I'm doing good, Steve. Introduce everybody. Well, this is my, excuse me, this is daughter number one, Gabby, daughter number two, Taylor, daughter number three, Rachel, and daughter number four, Emily. Mm. Welcome to the show. Let's win some money. Let's get it on. Give me Tracy. Give me Quine. Mm. Ladies, we got the top five answers on the board. Mm. Name something a person might change if they were hiding from the law. Tracy, name, name. Mm. Pass play? Play. They're going to play. Gabby, name something a person might change if they were hiding from the law. Address, address. Mm. Taylor. Name something a person might change if they were hiding from the law. Hair. Hair. Mm. Rachel, name something a person might change if they were hiding from the law. Clothes, clothes. Mm. 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 Emily, name something a person might change if they were hiding from the law. Your place of employment, your place of employment. Mm. Tracy one strike. Sex change. Sex change. Mm. Let's go on to question two. Give me Gabby. Give me Marquez.
Folks, we got the top six answers on the board. What will you do if you found out your house was haunted? Pray, pray. Move, move. Pass a play. Pass a play. Play. They're going to play. Taylor, what will you do if you found out your house was haunted? Investigate. Investigate. Rachel, what will you do if you're found, excuse me, what will you do if you found out your house was haunted? Sell tickets. Sell tickets. Mm. Mm. All right. What will you do if you found out your new house was haunted? Burn it down. Burn it down. Mm. One strike, Tracy. What will you do if you found out your new house was haunted? Nothing. Nothing. Mm. Two strikes, Gabby. The Carswell family can steal. How about Sage it? Sage it. What would you do if you found out your new house was haunted? Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters. Mm. Number six. Simpson Family 99, Carswell Family 82, the goal is 300 points, don't go away, so come right back. Welcome back to Family Feud, everybody. We got a good one. Simpson Family got 99. Carswell family got 82. Give me Taylor, give me Gwendolyn. <laughs> Ladies, point values are doubled. We got the top five answers on the board. Name something with teeth. Dog. Dog! Mm. Player pass. Play. They're gonna play. Mm. Rachel, name something with teeth. 
Shark. Shark. Emily, name something with teeth. Human, human. Tracy, name something with teeth. Alligator, alligator. Good answer, good answer. Gabby, one answer left. No strikes, name something with teeth. Comb, comb. Assistant Family 267, Carswell Family 82. And remember this, folks, if the Carswell family wins today's game, they're going to drive out here in a brand new car. We'll find out. We'll be right back right after this. Closed captioning is sponsored in part by... Welcome back to Family Feud Emmy nomination. <laughs> Since the family 267. Carswell family got 82. And remember this. If the Carswell family wins today's game, they're going to drive out here in a brand new car. Let's go see. Give me Rachel. Give me April. Let's go. Ladies, the point values are tripled. We got the top four answers on the board. We asked 100 women, name something with a motor that's in the necessity. Rachel, car, car. Mm. Fast play. Play, they're gonna play. <laughs> Emily, we asked 100 women, name something with a motor that's in the necessity. Vacuum, vacuum. Tracy, we asked 100 women, name something with the motor that's in the necessity. Blender. Blender! <laughs> Gabby, one answer left. If it's there, your family wins the game. It's not there, you're still alive, no strikes. Vibrator. This is for the win. Vibrator. <laughs> so proud of y'all, family. Good, good, good. Having a good time. Hey, I need two people. Fast money. Let's go. I got Tracy and I got Rachel. Congratulations. Y'all won the game and we're seeing your family on a carnival cruise set sail to the Bahamas 
Caribbean or Mexico enjoy amazing on board activities and unbelievable island adventures, Carnival wants you to choose fun. Plus, both families are taken home by new All Stars ed editions board game found exclusively at Walmart. We'll be right back to play Fast Money right after this. You ready? Ready. 20 seconds on the clock. Name something other than french fries that you wouldn't put ketchup on. Hamburger. At what age does a kid get braces? 12. Name a complaint parents might have about a big theme park. Too much money. Name something you write when filling out a check. The date, fill in the blank. Blank Derby. Ah! Kentucky. Here we go. Name something other than French fries that you would put ketchup on, you said. Hamburger survey said. At what age does a kid get braces, you said. 12, survey said. Name a complaint parents might have about a big theme park, you said. Too much money, survey said. Name something you write when filling out a check, you said. The date, survey said. Fill in the blank. Blank Derby, you said. Kentucky, survey said. All right, Rachel, yes, Steve, your mom got 189 points. Woo! You ready? I'm ready. Reminds everybody of your mom's answers. 25 seconds on the clock. Name something other than french fries that you would put ketchup on. Hot dog. At what age does a kid get braces? Four. Name a complaint parents might have about a big theme park. Too many people. Name something you write when filling out a check. My sign, sign it, uh, signature. Fill in the blank, derby, excuse me, fill in the blank, blank derby. Demolition, mm, demolition. Mm. 
Name something other than French fries that you would put ketchup on, you said. Hot dog. We need 11 points from $20,000. Survey said. Hamburger was the number one answer. At what age does a kid get braces? 12 years old was the number one answer. Name a complaint Paris might have about a big theme park. Crowded, long lines, number one answer. Name something you write when filling out a check. The date, number one answer. Fill in the blank. Blank Derby. Kentucky was the number one answer. Well, they did it. That's $20,000. And they're coming back to play Family Feud. And don't forget, folks, grab my new All Stars Edition board game exclusively at Walmart. I'm Steve Harvey. We'll see you next time, folks.